The ancient books recommend that to train, one should drive one's head against the wall at least a hundred times a day, five days a week for a year. But it must be stressed that without experienced supervision of a master, serious or even fatal injuries could result. 跟住呢一項表演亦係非常危險，任何冇經過訓練嘅人唔可以隨便嘗試。訓練技術亦係高度危險嘅，可能造成腦部嘅嚴重損傷。據古人傳下嘅秘訣話，鍛鍊嘅時候每日要用頭部撞喺牆壁上至少一百次，一星期五日要學足一年。但係要指出嘅就係、是，如果冇教練嘅指導，隨時係可能發生嚴重損傷意外嘅。Head is sandwiched between the slabs. 郭六登嘅头部夹喺上下石块嘅中间。啊！ Amazingly, he's unhurt, although his head has broken the bottom slab. 奇怪嘅就系，虽然佢嘅头部将底下嗰啲石块移开，但系佢毫无损伤。Resisting a sharp spear is another traditional way of demonstrating vital force. Deng Pazia is concentrating his vital force to his neck. 呢一支銀槍係表演氣功嘅另一種傳統方法。呢位運動員將氣功集中喺佢嘅頸部。So is his partner Zhu Zhongfu. The spear has two sharp ends, and each must know when the other is ready. 佢嘅搭檔朱忠普亦係一樣。呢支銀槍兩頭都係尖利嘅，佢哋兩人都必須知道對方是否已經準備好。They begin practicing with a blunt rod, and then gradually sharpen it until they are ready to withstand the sharp spear's point. You'll find pushing even a finger into the base of your neck too painful to endure for long. They start the practice by using a blunt rod, and then gradually sharpen it until they are ready to withstand the sharp spear's point. You'll find pushing even a finger into the base of your neck too painful to endure for long. They begin p r a c t Again with spears, Guo demonstrates an even more difficult feat. The force at the spear tip is many tons, and Guo has to concentrate his vital force at two spots at once. 郭六登亦用銀槍嚟表演一項更驚險嘅氣功，喺槍尖嘅力量係好大嘅。郭六登必須將佢嘅氣功立刻集中喺兩個部位。
to be here. Grove explains that the next demonstration you're about to witness can sometimes go wrong, and he sometimes gets cut. As if lying on a bed of glass isn't enough, Guo is about to become part of an amazing sandwich with Sao Ji Su and Guan Anpo. Those paving slabs are very heavy. Now on top of Sao, they place three more. are really forceful, and Sao enthusiastically breaks the final slab. With this demonstration, the vital force isn't concentrated on one particular spot, it's spread generally throughout the whole body. After all that violent pounding, Guo springs up, uncut by the glass. Guo, 
Sao Ji Su demonstrates here just how sharp that broadsword is. Meanwhile, Guo has concentrated his vital force in his stomach. The ancient Chinese masters said that when the vital force is concentrated in the stomach, it becomes as hard as iron. This is sometimes called bag kung, after a famous master whose bag, his stomach, was full of vital force. It needs to be. The broadsword slices through those wooden rods.